What happens when you combine a retro bike with vintage styling? Well, you get this Schwinn Murata. I recently picked this Schwinn up, or at least the frame, in with a bunch of free bike scrap parts. And the frame color really caught my eye. And it was a pretty cool bike overall, but there was also a cruiser bike that I saw in the mix. And that got me thinking, what if I put those wheels on this bike? And that was where it all started. This Schwinn Murata has a very not early 90s feel with that bright blue color and the cantilever brakes with thummy shifters, 21 speed, the chromoly tubing frame is feels like an 80s and 90s mountain bike. The squishy avocet gel seat along with a short stem paired with relatively wide and a short stem makes a pretty upright feel while riding the bike, which is very different compared to many 80s and 90s mountain bikes, which have the super long stem in the front. The short stem and lots of sweep of the bars really puts you in an upright position, which is something that I have never really found before in a bike of this era. The shifting sort of works. Probably the biggest part that needs replacing is the cables itself. The shifters, the thummy shifters, and the derailleur are in pretty good condition and aren't beat up that very much either. So all of that works pretty well. And that just makes for a great bike. And probably my favorite part about this bike is how well it wheelies. For some reason, you can just get back real easily, find the bouncing point, and just stay there. And ride on one wheel for as long as you want. Just make sure to have your fingers over the brake just in case you go back. Overall, this Schwinn Murata is a pretty sweet bike.